Good morning. Today is Sunday, August 7th, 2022. Week 192. Here we are. Here we are. Day late. Schedules changed at very last minute yesterday, so. <laughs> yeah, a phone call just before <laughs> you were supposed to get up and go in, and then they called you in different hours. That happens like always for us. And then she comes home and sits down with the laptop and she's messing with her schedule because somebody changed it again. And then she goes in and changes our week in Google Calendar. And then mm -hmm. I look at it and it didn't refresh. <coughs> and then I think she's home and she's not home. Yeah, it's always that way. <laughs> it's just our crazy life. Our crazy life. That's yep. what it is. I'm going to start this week. So you go ahead and start this week. Ladies first. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Um, last week I weighed in at 163, and today I weighed in at 163. Well, you're consistent. So I'll take it. Yeah. I'd like the yeah. number to be lower. 136 was much better, but Stacey did okay. better than me this week. I was 344 last week, and I was 345 this morning. So, but you know what? At the same time, um, I won't share, but there are things that could happen that in the next half hour even that would change that. So... Yeah, we had a really good dinner last night. We got the, the griddle going, the Blackstone, mm -hmm. and we did up some smashy burgers, and I just ate mine without a bun with a little bit of onion on it, and it was wonderful. One The one thing we're using is that Blackstone seasoning that's yeah. called Whiskey Burger. Yeah. doesn't even sound good. I don't like whiskey or anything, but whatever's in that mix, it really gives a burger a It's unique, a very nice flavor. A nice, unique kick. And uh, we, we did those smash burgers. We kept it real simple. Shook some of that on there. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. I think we put a piece of cheddar cheese on it too, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if you ate the one. I yep, ate Yep, I had a cheese. cheese one. And you have one to take to work today. I do. So yeah, it'll be great. I'm excited. Been uh, still trying to keep with that carnivore uh, attitude. And like last night, I could have had a keto bun or something, but I just ate it on the plate. So that worked out well. Uh, I did see the doctor this week. On Tuesday, I saw the doctor. We've made major changes to all my medicines. Um, not really so much for the diabetes stuff, really, but a lot of other issues and things that I have going on that you guys don't need to know about all that junk. But, um, yeah, I'm having some other issues. Walking, falling, arthritic kind of things. My yeah. heart was going crazy, but I stopped the coffee and that helped that. Um, you know, just, <coughs> just life getting old. <laughs> Falling apart, feeling like I'm broken, but I'm encouraged by his thoughts yeah. and the directions that he wants to go with some of these changes, and uh, I'm hoping that they help. It, it's still way too new. Stacy literally just filled two of them yeah. yesterday for me, and uh, we played with some dosages, and we're just trying to get me feeling good, you know. Yep. And and doing better. My A1C was down 0.7. Yeah, it was 0. 0.7 down, so he was happy to see that. I was a little surprised because I didn't see a number of correlation with weight loss. But, hey, it means I'm doing something right. Maybe this carnivore is helping a little. Yeah. You know, because I've been kind of going that direction of really steering clear of the salads and the veggies and stuff. And just a lot of times a lot of it is eggs. I like eggs. I do like eggs. I turned my daughter on to... <laughs> <laughs> I like sunny side up eggs. I always have called them dipping eggs. Dipping eggs. And um, Julia is very picky, kind of like I was. And I kept telling her, I said, if I like it, most likely you'll like it. And so I was making them for my oldest daughter, who was very excited. She's like, Mom, will you please? I said, yeah, I'll make them. And uh, so Julia says, I think I'd like to try one. Is that okay? And I said, of course. So, of course, I'm thinking in my mind, all right, if I make her two, and I'll have one of them, probably one and a half of them. And she them, won't eat it, right? Because I didn't think she was going to eat it. She loves it. I turned it. around and they were gone. She goes, can I have another one? <laughs> and Stacy was at work and Julia came out and said, can I have those eggs, those dipping eggs or whatever? <laughs> I said, well, honey, we got to buy more eggs. We're out of eggs. <laughs> so I texted Stacy at work. I'm like, can you please bring home eggs for your daughter? Because she wants your dipping eggs. She goes, next time you make them, will you please call me? And then here's the bad part. We didn't have bread. I didn't realize we didn't have bread because she wants the toast to dip in the egg. So you have to bring home some bread. I or I have run out. Bread. Or yeah. I could run and get some. I'll get some bread tonight. But yeah, so bread. <laughs> bread and eggs. So that's her new, one of her new favorites, I think. Um, she's I'll expanding eat. what she'll eat, which has been really nice. I'll eat a dip in egg, but I just don't do the bread. Yeah. Sometimes you just mix it up. For me, it's just scrambled eggs, sometimes a little bit of bacon bits in it. 
or a little cheese. I did a fried egg the other day. That was really good. Do you break the yolk and then just smash it and then flip it? Mm -hmm. Do you just eat that on the plate or do you put it on anything? You can put it on bread. If I, I used to eat it with bread and mustard and then, um, but now I just, you know, you can just eat it just with the, just the egg. Just a different flavor, just a different consistency. I don't know. Okay. I like eggs. <clears throat> you do good on your water. I see you got this. She's got this enormous water bottle. I and, forgot uh, it at work because it was such a weird big. day. Yeah, it's a thermo flask. It's got to um, be like 40 ounces I think it's like more. 40 ounces. So I've been really, my goal is, and I know it doesn't seem like a lot for a lot of people, but I already have issues with my bladder and I drink. So I, she tries to drink a full one of those every day? I try to drink at least a full one every day. I've been um, averaging one full one and then a 16 ounce bottle of water. Um, That's good. Which is pretty good for me because I could not drink anything and go to the bathroom you know, three times in an hour, like I hadn't gone all day. So I struggle with that. It's hard at work, I know. And it's hard at work because it's busy. busy. I just got a promotion this week. Yay, um, Stacey's... Uh, I'm a front-end supervisor. Doing good. So <clears throat> that was exciting. So that's part of also why my schedule is... Changing. Changing. A little different, evolving into new yeah. positions and methods and stuff. Yeah. And will this mean that I'll see you with different shifts... Like where I might see you for dinner instead of coming home at 10 o'clock? Or is it going to yes. vary? No, it'll vary. We'll probably do some opening, some closing, some mids. Um, some people prefer um, One over the, the closing shifts. Um, yeah. Not everybody, but we have a couple people that prefer the closing shifts because that works better with their schedule. Um, I don't mind the closing shifts, but I don't want to do a closing shift every day. Okay. So. Well... I guess we're going to get going. Stacey's got to head off to work. And uh, I, I'm pretty optimistic about the changes that I've made here in um, the foods. And uh, I'm not really seeing it really on the morning sugars, but my A1C was down 0.7. So I'll take that. Yeah. And um, I'm hopeful that some of these changes give me some better quality of life. I've just been feeling very, like cramped up and arthritic -y kind of and yeah. I've had a couple other issues going on and one Hope by one yeah one by one doc says let's let's focus on what's the worst thing let's fix that yeah. <laughs> and that's what we're working on so I'm, I'm very hopeful and thankful so you know I appreciate his candor he's just you gotta get this done yeah so I'm gonna do my best you do your best yeah you do, you your, do best. your best now I'll do my I'll do my best let's do better okay <laughs> all right guys well take care and we will see you next week and hopefully have some even better news who Sounds knows like we'll a plan. get these meds in me for a week maybe i'll be out running marathons maybe not probably not <laughs> most likely not <laughs> but gotta be optimistic and hope right. for the best we'll do many so everybody have a great one and we will see you next week bye, bye. <laughs>